Hello, my name is David Wallowidnick, and thank you for tuning in to the BC Liquor Store YouTube channel. I'm an award-winning bartender, a spirit educator, and the resident cocktail stylist of Taste Magazine. Although we might have some travel restrictions in the summer of 2021, you can still travel afar by way of the cocktail. And tequila cocktails are incredibly popular right now. Beyond a beautiful, fresh lime margarita, which I do love, there are some other lovely classic tequila cocktails that I'd like to highlight for you. This one is called the Matador. If you look it up, there are a few different variations out there. This particular variation is my favorite out of all of them, and it involves only three simple ingredients. A Blanco tequila, freshly squeezed lime juice, and pineapple juice, ideally fresh squeezed, but if you can get any pineapple juice, just get a decent quality one and it'll make the drink fantastic. Let's get mixing. We'll start off by grabbing a shaking tin and my Blanco tequila. This one today, I've chosen the Cazadores Blanco tequila. Blanco or silver tequila means that it hasn't been aged in wood. It is often rested though, rested for up to two months in a stainless steel vat, what this does, it allows for the spirit to just relax and kind of soften the edges a little bit. This is 1.5 fluid ounces or 45 milliliters of that Blanco tequila. Depending on the sweetness level of your pineapple juice, with this one, it is nice and bright, but um, I feel like it needs three quarters of an ounce, which is the average that you'll typically use. If you have a particularly sweet pineapple juice, maybe scale that back to half an ounce. And the pineapple juice. This one, three ounces. So there's two, there's three. Three ounces is 90 mils. Now all we have to do is shake it up, pour it into a glass, and garnish. So let's add some ice to this shaker. All right. There we go. And while I'm at it, I'm going to add just a little bit of ice to this glass. I like serving this one in a wine glass, and you'll see why. It just looks beautiful when it's done. Now let's shake it up. Now, some people may want to fine strain out those little tiny ice particles. I don't want to do that with this one. I actually like those little shards of ice because they add some great texture to the drink. And the cool thing about pineapple juice, when you shake it, it becomes beautifully frothy. Now let's garnish with a nice piece of pineapple here. All right. Give a little slice and into the glass it goes. That, my cocktail friends, is a beautiful matador, a classic tequila cocktail. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and that little bell icon below. It will notify you when we post more of these videos. Thanks for watching, and I look forward to seeing you again real soon.